Greetings, I'm Evan Swenson. I'm an author and a book publisher and member of Author Masterminds. I first met Jim Misko when he came to my office and asked about publication consultants publishing his new novel, The Cut of Pride. This was the beginning of a close relationship associated with writing and publishing. We later published Jim's award-winning As All My Fathers Were. Jim, the founder of the Alaska Writers Guild, asked me to serve on the board of directors, which I did for several years. During my service, I also served as the Guild's president. The Guild established the Founders Award in honor of Jim Misko. In 2013, I was the recipient of this award in recognition of my service with the Guild. My friendship and business association with Jim has been unique. Jim spent winters in the desert and summers in Alaska. Consequently, our summer relationship was more eyeball to eyeball, and winter was emails and telephone calls. Three Christmases ago, I received a gift of a fine Advon and Colby shirt from Jim. It was the finest shirt I ever owned. I liked it so much I decided to order other colors. When I found out the price of the shirt, I decided I could not afford to buy one. But finding out the cost made the gift Jim gave me even more valuable. The next Christmas, Jim duplicated the shirt gift, only with a different color. Then a few weeks prior to last Christmas, Jim was hospitalized with cancer. I visited with Jim several times before and after Christmas. On each visit, Jim was upbeat and expressed optimism for his cure. He was concerned that the effects of the cancer would affect his walking, but he strongly expressed that his cancer was licked. Three days after Christmas, Jim apologized for not being able to send me a shirt before Christmas this year, but now that he was feeling better, he was going to send me another Advon and Colby shirt. The next day, I received an email from Jim, quote, shirt ordered, should receive in a couple of days, watch for it. I appreciate so much what you do in an honorable way for authors and enjoy our friendship and understanding of the book business. You have opened paths for me when I was a beginning author that would have taken much time and search. Send photo of you in new khaki shirt when stretched over your shoulders. May it go well with you into the new year." Close quote. Attached to my thank you email was a photo of me wearing the first shirt he gifted me. And, told, and I told him I would send the photo when the new shirt arrives. That was my last correspondence with Jim. On the last day of December, Jim passed away. Jim's passing, his gifting me a fine shirt during his last few days on earth, has left me with emotions I cannot put into words. His last act toward me has left me with a lasting impression of a good man with a good heart. I trust that wherever Jim is, he'll see this short video of me wearing the shirt he gifted me. Thanks for the shirt, Jim. Thanks for your friendship. May it go well with you in your new adventure.